the idea for our greenhouse it, it originally originated with a superintendent we had um, back in 2014 and she had talked to me about if our staff might be interested in having a greenhouse because she knew about Monsanto grants that we could apply for. There are only three elementary greenhouses that we know of in the state of Kansas. Each classroom kind of perfected one thing as we're hopeful that you know our, then they can learn a lot through through their time here. Second grade started geraniums from plugs so they are kind of the geranium experts of the school. The thing that I like the most has been some of the craft projects we've done along with the greenhouse such as uh, planter boxes. They've learned so much and their vocabulary has expanded so much um, they talk about propagating plants and, you know, these things that I've even had parents come to me like, I don't even know what they're talking about. I think there was a little bit of skepticism with, with how much work might be involved, but, you know, it's amazing how quick that went away when we found out how much fun it is and how much the kids think it's fun. Teaching became easier. Um, it allowed us to be more creative, think outside the box, uh, you know, come up with, with new ways of teaching math, new ways of teaching science that, that perhaps we weren't engaging students with before. The plant sale has been a team effort. We tried to fill with what we grew on our own first and then we just ordered the extra. It's really become a community project and that's what we hope to have with it and I think the teachers want a, a lot of outside people from in the community whether it be farmers or agriculture related business or just just some elderly people that, that you know like to come into schools and work with kids and do some gardening. Once we started thinking about greenhouses we started thinking about uh, what else can we tie in with it? And animals were our next logical step. So chickens have shown up in our backyard again, and uh, and uh, who knows what's going to be next? I think is the attitude we're kind of taking right now. 